So I have this Honda CRV. This is the one that got hit down low and in the back, and the floor is nice and wadded up. I have a new trunk floor right here. This one actually, they have a sectioning procedure to put it in at this brace back here. I cut 15 millimeters in front of this, cut this floor pan out, then the other one overlaps. So I'm gonna go ahead and make some pulls. I'm gonna grab this and pull it out to walk out all the other damage. And then I will go ahead and start cutting that floor pan out. So it looks like Honda wants this cut 15 millimeters back from the edge of the brace here. So I'm gonna mark that in a few spots and put a piece of tape down as a cut line. I'm gonna make my cut across here. There it is. Well, I got this floor all fit up, ready to weld. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna get this one zapped in. Alright, I just about have this one all welded together. All I have left is I have to put on this brace right here. That had to come up because the floor gets lapped underneath it.
So we ended up having to drop the suspension down on this one because where the seam is, where the floor goes in, there was no way I was going to get to that in order to clean it up and seam seal it and because it was buried behind all of this and it would have it would have eventually caused moisture to get in there and it would have started rusting away. We dropped the suspension loose, I cleaned it all up and I'm going to seam seal it and then undercoat it and paint everything and then we'll put it all right back up. 